I'm very pleased to welcome you for this interview as a winner of uh, the Young Investigator Award and also the winner of the Moderated Poster Award. I start with the Dr. Schrotten. Can you present yourself? Yes, I'm uh, from the University Medical Center Groningen in the Netherlands, uh, the Department of Cardiology. Um, and I was uh, invited here for the Young Investigator Award session to present a study we did in the PREVENT on renin as a cardiovascular risk predictor. Yes, I saw that uh, the topic of your presentation was renin predict cardiovascular events in the general population independently of aldosterone or hemodynamic parameters. Mm -hmm. Am I right? Yes. Okay. So, how do you feel about this, uh, about winning this award? I think it's very important. Um, for, first of all, it um, is um, a very good, um, well, appreciation of the work uh, the group has been doing. Uh, second of all, it's also very important for the patients that participate in the study that these results uh, are uh, come out and that people can um, appreciate uh, the work that has been done. Is it a surprise for you? I must say I was um, very um, timid at first. Um, as the, co the other people in my session were also very good. And um, I'm, yeah, I'm, I was hoping so, but you never know, it's, uh, it can go either way. So congratulations. Thank Did you. you expect this award because the competition was very tough, apparently? Well, it's, it's, it's very difficult to predict um, who's going to win. And um, I must say, up front, I, uh, I thought I had equal chances as my, uh, the other uh, presenters. What might this change for you in the future? I think it's a very good uh, stimulation to continue this line of research. And um, it's also a very good opportunity to meet other researchers and uh, to exchange thoughts to uh, improve your research. Okay. Uh, I would like to ask you what represents for you the European Society of Cardiology? Um, the European Society of Cardiology um, is very important in organizing um, congresses like this where investigators can meet, where you can exchange ideas. And I think it's a very good initiative that they also stimulate uh, young investigators to come here so that they can also learn from uh, more established investigators on how to do research. Do you think that ESC is doing enough for the young and the young cardiologist and young researcher? I, b I believe um, they're trying very hard. Of course, um, we could use as much help as possible. And um, I think it, especially w for us, it's very important to get in touch with uh, other researchers and uh, with renowned uh, investigators. So you plan to still work with the European Society of Cardiology? I hope so. You hope so. So congratulations again. And now I'm turning to you, the other winner of this uh, it was a moderated poster award winner. Your name is uh, Askevold, and you are from Norway, if I'm right. That's correct. Would you tell me what was the topic of your uh, moderated poster? Well, my uh, poster was entitled uh, Soluble GP130 Predicts Outcomes in the Controlled uh, uh, or the Corona Trial, the Erosivastatin Trial, which is well known. And this was a post hoc analysis, and GP130 is. Um, a common receptor subunit for the interleukin-6 family of cytokines and we found it to be um, an independent predictor of mortality in this uh, subset of, uh, of the po uh, corona population. Okay, how do you feel after being selected as the winner? Well, it was Relax, a great surprise. So yeah, it was a great surprised? surprise, yeah. Um, in fact, I wasn't even aware that there was a competition, so... Um, <laughs> So it was a great surprise for me, and yeah, a great tough, honor. Tough competition. Yeah, there were many great presenters, and um, and uh, yeah, for sure it was. Uh, and as I said, I wasn't even aware of the competition. So so um, um, I'm honored to to have been selected among so many worthy competitors. So so yes, great honor for me. 
Is it a, a corner in your uh, profile in your work in the future? Is it a cornerstone? Well, I think this. Um, I think perhaps this uh, award uh, reflects two things. It, it reflects that um, we have a great working collab uh, collaboration at my lab and and at my hospital, and we have a stimulating group of people. Um, our main focus is, is inflammation and heart failure, and I think perhaps this award reflects that. Um, this work has some significance, and also um, to have won the um, uh, this moderated poster session perhaps means that also um, I was able to to convey the message that we as a group have uh, worked towards. So I think it was, it was um, very nice for the whole group as well. Oh, excellent! So it's stimulating for the, for the group for your team. Yes, I think so because. Okay. Um, I ask the same question that uh, your colleague. What the society, the European Society of Cardiology, mean for you, young cardiologist? Well, I think it's an uh, important. Um, uh, I think it is important for for um, for young investigators and young cardiologists to um, to have the opportunity to present their data and uh, and uh, show that they have. Um, uh, they do good research and also um, it is, uh, I think it's a learning curve to, to be able to present and convey your, your message and, and get your research through to other people and this is a great opportunity to, to do so and also it's interesting to, um, to, to be able to meet others uh, within the same research fields as, uh, as you are yourself uh, working in and perhaps uh, make some bridges and, and, and do some networking also. So I think it's all in all, it's a very good experience to, to have these kind of uh, congresses. Yeah. So you think that it is really a prestigious award? Yeah, for sure. Mm, same levels that the uh, other award in America, for example, American Heart Association or American College of Cardiology? Excuse me? Is it the same level of uh, well, prestige that... I think that is very difficult for me to to um, evaluate, but for sure, personally, I, I feel that this is, um, yeah, for sure, at least of the same magnitude as, as um, the other American Congresses you mentioned. Okay, so finally, congratulations to both of you, and you. all my best wishes for the future of your career, and to join uh, and to link again with the European Society of Cardiology Working Group, etc. So, thanks so much. And Thank have you. a nice afternoon. Thank you. Thank you very much.